UNLV men's soccer kicked off the first game of the Peter Johan Memorial Classic here at UNLV against the number two team in the nation, the Gales of St. Mary's. Coming into the game, the Gales stood with an undefeated record, exciting the Rebels with a chance to prove their strengths. Throughout the opening half, both teams flexing defensive efforts, keeping neck and neck with only five combined shots and no goals scored. Player of the game, goalie Lucas Betts, who solidified seven saves overall, shares his thoughts on the team's play. Yeah, mentally we, we knew it was a strong opponent, number two in the country. Uh, we knew it was going to be a tough game, uh, but we knew our strengths and uh, knew we could, we could play and uh, outwork them uh, because we have a good team. We, we're good in the back, playing out, and uh, I thought we showed that in the first half. Following halftime, a turn of events as the game became marred by cards. Red and yellow flew for both sides, and the Rebels faced the challenge of keeping a high morale. Fans didn't like the calls either. What began as a riveting competition quickly shifted to an unwanted match between refs and players. With a final score and Gale's victory of 2-0, to zero, we spoke to Coach Ryerson to get his thoughts on how the team would move past the loss. We always want to challenge ourselves to play against the best that there are. St. Mary's uh, is a fantastic team. I think they're very well coached, very disciplined, a lot of international experience. We're 2-5 we're and five now, so we uh, obviously want a good performance Sunday night. And uh, yeah, just uh, kind of rebuild, uh, rethink where we are. Uh, we replace one red card with another red card. So we've gotten two red cards the last two games on fouls. And uh, we just need to clean up our defending. Now keep in mind, the Rebels haven't even stepped into conference play yet. But after a resilient performance against a nationally ranked team, there's certainly a lot of promise for the season as it continues. For the Rebel Report, I'm Sam Mann.